Hey y'all, it's Ashley. Um, I just decided to come with another lock update. It's literally like 11 o'clock at night, I'm in bed, but I wasn't really doing anything, so I was like, let me make a lock update. So, I am 27 months locked now, and the last time that you guys saw me, I was talking about extending all my locks. So, uh, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I did. I extended my locks. Now, when I first extended my locks, they were probably about like, they probably went to like right down here. I extended just the ones in the front. All the ones in the back are still just mine, but I added about, um, let's see, my hair, my real hair stops right here I could tell this lock it's very soft right here so my real hair stops right here so I added about four inches um, initially I added about six inches to each lock just in the front so I kind of had like a bob thing going on because I was working my way from my front to the back and I was gonna extend all of my locks so I wanted like a lot of length but then I realized after extending like 20 of them, like 10 on each side in the front, that maybe just by having the ones in the front be at least the same length as the ones in the back, it would be fine. So I cut off about four inches on each lock that I had and I added it to like one like in the back. So like this lock stops right here and then all of this part is what I what I cut off from like the front so I got this hair from Macon Styles um, and um, I had to actually cultivate the lock it just comes as like a key a kinky bulk oh you know what I have it right beside me um, this is the hair it just comes like as a, a bulk of hair and you make the lock yourself. I bought um, three bundles. No, I bought four because like I said, I thought I was gonna do my entire head, but I ended up only using like three fourths of one because I only added hair to the front. So I would say about now, I added extensions to probably about maybe 12 on this side and 12 on this side. So maybe about 24, if not maybe 30 locks, maybe 15 on each side. But like all the locks in the back, all of these are, that's my hair, that's my own length. And you can kind of tell the difference between like, my lock is really hard um, and it's, smooth versus the locks that I added the extension at the end you see how like frizzy it is at the end so my lock is my lock is like smooth at the end even though it's bumpy there's no sticky I'm sticky there's no frizzies um, sticking out but the locked hair that the extension hair that it's still frizzy at the end. So that's really the only way you could tell. But other than that, it's pretty seamless. It has bumps and stuff in it, but so do my own locks. My own locks are really, well, this is one that I'm, um, this is a lock that I'm joining right now, but like my own locks aren't like, they're bumpy, you know, this is my lock and it's pretty bumpy. And the locks that I added, the hair that I added is pretty bumpy, but I don't know. I don't think you can really, like, nobody can tell that I added lock extensions unless I actually tell them, which I don't. <laughs> because why get lock extensions if you're going to tell everyone? So um, I really, really, really love them. I'm so happy I did it. I, I don't feel, I thought that maybe I would feel some type of way about doing it, but I actually just love it. Like, it gives me so much more versatility. Like, I can do 
so much more stuff with my hair now that I have more length in the front because I always had length in the back and the back of my hair is just steadily growing but the front was just taking so long like literally the front was like it only came to like here at first now it's like here but the actual extension comes all the way down so um I wear my hair mostly in side parts sometimes I'll do a bun um but yeah I just love it I'm very very happy with it I haven't had a retwist in probably about I haven't washed my hair in about two weeks maybe three and I haven't had a retwist um in maybe about a month and I just um I'm, I'm really just getting I put some edge control on my edges because my edges just be looking crazy but um I'm probably gonna wash my hair I might ombre it tomorrow like I'm thinking about putting some color on the extension part like an ombre effect just like a blonde and only in the front I don't know let me know if you guys think that might look good but um I kind of just want like ombre like to lighten it for the rest of the summer and for the fall and then maybe go back to black in the winter but um I don't know we'll see but um yeah I have a lot of loose hair um because I need to retwist it but um y'all know I don't retwist my hair like I don't care about retwisting my hair. Um, my actual hair is just, is looking good, it's thriving. This one is just so bumpy. This is not even where I added the hair. Like literally, that's my hair. I added hair right here. From here, where my finger is down, is added. All of this before that is just my own hair. And I don't palm roll my own hair. I just, reach when I do, retwisted I only retwist the front like the the root I don't palm roll all the way down and I don't really care to either but um yeah my hair is let me show y'all it's growing um it's dirty I'm sorry it's so gross um but whatever I am using still oil and water. Um, what else am I doing? I'm tying it up at night when I remember. I'm really, really trying to be good at tying it up at night. I spritz it probably about twice a week with like conditioner and um, water. Um, so like the conditioner I use is like Cantu and it's watered down a lot, like significantly. And I just spritz it with that probably twice a week. And I put, um, an oil on my scalp and kind of run it through my hair. Um, what else? Um, nothing other than that. I don't think I'm going to extend my locks anymore. I'm pretty happy with them. Um, they're pretty strong. I literally took, let me see if I have one. Nope, I don't. Um, I took a crochet needle and cultivated the locks. There's videos on it, so I'm not going to go into how it's done. But I cultivated the locks. Each lock took me probably about five minutes to make from the loose kinky hair and then it took me probably about three minutes to um add to my lock so like I just kind of like weaved it into my own hair so they're strong like I haven't had any fall out I haven't had like a scare of them falling out like I haven't been worried about them falling out or anything like that um I love it. I'm so happy I did it and I would definitely do it again. Um, and I get compliments on my hair all the time. I'm just so glad that it's like all one, um, all one length now. Like that's what I wanted. And so that's cool. Anyway, uh, if you guys have any questions for me, just leave them 
in the description in the description leave them in the comment box um one last look at my hair i love it still love my locks i probably love them even more now that i have like more to do with it um and they're just growing 27 months strong